just like any other experiment, you need to go in with um, everything defined, what's your hypothesis, what is the statistical approach you're using, what data would you accept, what wouldn't you accept, you know, the entire framework for the decision of how do I address my hypothesis and how do I know if it's true or not, right? So it, it makes perfect sense. And I think the, the other piece that's, that's in the framework is the transparency trying to make as much as possible transparent what the data set is, what is in there, what's not in there. What's the, um, what's the code used to actually you know, run your, your, your analysis? You know, all these kinds of things, when you have that level of transparency, the, the confidence that you're not just cherry picking, that the, the, the evidence that you're utilizing can be trusted, I think that's that's really what it, the other piece that it gets at. So between, yeah, be between actually having a framework in place, having the, the sort of, you know, the, the protocol, so to speak, in place, and then having a transparency so people know you actually did follow that protocol, it's, it makes sense, I, I think, for, for most people.